In our technologically savvy and sophisticated society, primitive phenomena like crime and discord are extinct. With the intrinsically human need for justice satiated, all energy turns to the betterment of civilization and our planet. Citizens work peacefully and fruitfully side by side and day by day to improve the conditions of all. These are selfless, determined individuals who have an earnest desire to send us further and further into the future. They include doctors, engineers, scientists, and teachers. Yeah, so uh, I work in the nuclear plant here on the stream. Cleanest source of energy, in my opinion. I'm a nuclear physicist, wanted to do it ever since five years old. Got my first internship working down the nuclear plant when I was 14. Loved it ever since. You know, some folks in other realms, it's dangerous down here. They think it's dangerous. But we got the joys of doing all the nasty jobs. A lot of people are always asking me, they say, us, when you're not working at the power plant, what is it that you do? What, what do you do for fun? And I tell them, listen, there ain't nothing more fulfilling or adrenaline inducing than dragon hunting. My pa taught me how when I was just a little lad, and I brought my boy out for the first time just the other day. They ain't real dragons, of course, but the man who discovered them named them that because they resemble the mythical beasts, you know, small, uh, other, other famous dragons, that's what they look like. Uh, each about 30 to 40 foot long, uh, enormously strong tails, razor sharp claws and teeth, but they still ain't got no wings or the breathing fire, you know, that's just the myth. Uh, but they, the good part is that they're blind and they're slow. Uh, from living on the ground for so long, so you can really sneak on them and uh, sneak up on them and, uh, and get them. But that's, the, the hard armor makes them hard to kill, and uh, that's where the sport is. How do I kill them? That's the fun part. Gotta chuck a spear right through their eye. You know, some guys, you know, they like to use laser guns and plasma swords, you know, the newfangled stuff, but I like to go in right for the gun the way my pa taught me. There ain't nothing more delicious than a dragon flank steak. Tender and juicy. Mm-mm-mm. Dragon meat and bones are available in any food storage facility around the world, but it's freshest here in the Eastern Realm. No, I don't mind living underground. Most of the above land is in ruins from the war anyway. Most folk, myself included, Go up daily for some sunshine and fresh air, but uh, I got all I need down here. <laughs> Next, we'll be taking a look at one of our lively entertainers. He's a gladiator from the Western realm who uses the stage name Decimus Sicarius Extinctor. Here he is now. So, uh, Decimus, what's it like being a gladiator? Oh, well, you know, Bill, it's always a lot of fun getting to do what I love. And the fans are great. And even if I am really sore after all the exercise, I have a few women at home to tuck me in and <laughs> read me a bedtime story. Hey, yeah, I mean, I was gonna say, Decimus, you must be a real hit with the ladies. I mean, you're a real-life gladiator! <laughs> well, let's just put it this way. I haven't conquered as nearly as many battle droids as I have women. <laughs> so, uh, do you have kids? Probably. <laughs> but I'll never stay with one girl long enough to find out. Right, right, uh, I've got you there. But Desmond, the folks at home want to know, how did you become a gladiator? Well, becoming a gladiator is just like any other job. You go to primary school for about eight years or so, until you decide what you want to do. And then I start an apprenticeship for another eight years or so. And he taught me everything I needed to know. Here I am today. If we didn't have the freedom to choose whatever we wanted to do in the society, I'd probably be dead. You bet. I'd have ended it a long time ago too. So, I understand that you're gonna fight for us today. I don't know, should I? The people have spoken, Decimus. Let's get this thing started.
Why are you even a gladiator? There's so many other jobs you could have picked. Because this great nation allows me to do what I love. I love to fight on the power of Robo Bears. So guys, it uh, it looked pretty rough out there. Can you tell me what went on? Oh uh, well, we we're just out here doing our job, you know, put food on the table. Oh well, it's not really dangerous. I mean, no one dies in the arena. I mean, these weapons are fake. Yeah, you know I'm just glad to have the opportunity to do something I love that's so unique to the Western realm. I got all the respect in the world for this guy right here, man. You know, we both love fighting. We, we, it's just what we we're born to do, you know. We draw a lot of parallels to, to life from fighting. You know, we got our obstacles. Obstacles that we got to overcome. It ain't always easy, but if it wasn't for the power to choose, I'd probably be dead. So thanks for the great fight this evening, guys. Uh, well, what are you gonna do now? Oh, well, we'll probably go home, tear into a package of dragon flank steak from the Eastern Realm. Mm. Think I'm gonna go home, lay in the castle for a bit. Maybe ice will hurt 20 minutes off. 20 minutes off. So, Blue, uh, I understand you're not from the Western Realm. Um, where are you from? Uh, that is correct. I am. Uh, I'm from the north, uh, where we don't have these gladiator battles. So, uh, I really think it's a privilege for me to come and uh, referee these fights. For these fight kids. These kids are great. I mean, these kids come out and they go 100 percent, 100 percent every time. And it's just good to see them out here doing what they like. The power to choose, man. Some of these kids, if they didn't have the power to choose, they'd probably be dead by now. Yeah, man. You know, I love it so much. When I get back home, my place back up north, I'm gonna go on my community council and be like. Man, we should bring this gladiator battles battles to the north, man. You know what I'm saying? Cause the north the north don't have no gladiator battles.